Hello, my name is Ruta and I am female coach, emotional well-being practitioner, trauma integration specialist and holistic womb healing enthusiast. And today I wanted to talk to you about another mood diary topic, which is my mom diary now, which is sleep and exhaustion when being a new mother. So I recently became a mother three weeks ago and well, my journey was a little bit different, I guess, from the typical one because my baby was uh, neonatal, which means she was born premature and she was held for some time in a hospital. However, we got her like a week ago, a bit more than that. and. Um, It was my first experience of what people talk about, sleep deprivation, being up in the night, because while she was in the hospital, I wanted to get my milk going, so I was waking up and pumping the milk, but I didn't need to wake up and feed her or change the nappies or stay up with her as long as she needed. And then once we got her back, That's when we started to get into real feel or experience of what it's like to have a baby, newborn baby uh, at home and what it's like to have this night shift, so to speak. In my experience, it was really helpful while my partner was still on paternity leave and then while he's off, then actually it makes the night shifts better because um, you know he can do some things and it doesn't mean that we both need to not to sleep but to the way because I'm breastfeeding so I need to be the one who's up but I find that um, as long as I get some catch up naps during the day I'm able to function normally I'm not completely exhausted I'm not completely without it you know like lost it Um, and I feel like my emotionality is affected basically so the exhaustion or the lack of sleep affects my emotional state and on the days where I feel like I had little sleep and I had less chance to kind of nap and catch up on the sleep in the day this accumulated tiredness kind of builds up and that kind of puts a strain on my nervous system and then I feel like well I'm quite emotionally sensitive and like my emotional range is very wide I can go very high or very low very quickly moon and Pisces for those of you who are astrologers however I didn't really um, find what lots of people experience which is permanent exhaustion, you know, like being completely crazy. I actually feel like that is possible for normality or for healthy functioning to be there as long as you have a way to compensate. So basically it doesn't really have to, obviously, you know, like depends on on a personal circumstance and depends on the support that you have available, but It doesn't really have to be like a complete exhaustion all the time. It doesn't have to be like, you know, craziness all throughout those first few weeks. I already feel improvement in comparison to when we got her first at home. And now it's been, uh, okay, one week, two, three, three days, 10 days. I already see some positive improvement in you know like effectiveness and managing it and I think as long as I can compensate and manage and take it kind of like day by day rather than you know like overall as long as I can balance in in like 24 hours I'm okay so yeah that's been my experience about um, lack of sleep the exhaustion and I guess I will speak about postnatal depression in another time, 
but I'm kind of like uh, keeping my eye for it and it's not there <laughs> and I think it's not there because of two reasons one is because of the hormones that I have privilege to experience by having natural birth or you know as natural as it gets these days in a hospital <laughs> and the second reason is because in the course of the day I'm able to kind of manage or let's say most of the days I am able to manage the rest the tiredness to get support uh, and to get positive emotions and I think that kind of compensates the strain or the hard or or the you know the toughness of having to be there for the baby and be available with the breast milk every few hours <laughs> for those mothers who are breastfeeding out there shout out keep it up You're doing a great job and it's a tough job and it's always different when you are in it and you experience it you know in comparison when you think how it's gonna be so so that's me that's today that's my mood uh diary mom diary and i will see you next time bye